hi guys how you doing hope you're good um today i was out shopping so not really shopping it's more of thrifting i just shopping shopping in a car shopping shopping in a car i hope you guys can hear me because i'm not having my lapel right now this was an impromptu video so yeah and when you see me doing this it's because like the light is affecting me and of course i'm short-sighted and my specs are you don't know where they are but um i was i was checking out my clothes so um i was out on a haul thrifting yes after tungo tungo to 20 affordable to mtumba for those who are not understanding sahili i mean like going to the low cost market to look for clothes yeah so this this video is for plus size people or rather everyone but if you have plus size people around you, you can show them the video so i thought of um so many pluses are very very how will i say it um scared to try out how new clothes so um i went out bought um three sets of clothes i'll be showing you guys um you'll be seeing how i'll be combining my clothes to make myself pop than kufanyo no no you understand so the first thing let's take care of the babies the first thing i got this velvet I don't know how it's called this velvet thing um i got it at 200 nearly pata palengara um um how is it called kirinyaga road yeah i got it from kirinyaga road so i got it for 200 shillings and some people who are plus size let me show you most people wear their clothes like this like this this is not flattering at all First of all, you have a tummy, and of course, um, of course, the black clothes. One thing, rule number one for plus size people. Rule number one for plus size people. Don't how will I put it? Um, guys, let me take my lapel. But the lapel will take too much time. Okay, let me continue. I hope you guys can hear me. Rule number one: try getting darker shades. Okay. Uh, if you want bright shades, and sure you can be able to combine the shades. So I got this one for myself. Um, of course, I don't like clothes that show cleavage, if you understand me. But then I found this one to be really cute, and I'll be wearing with something on top. Let me show you what I'll be wearing with. Um, I can decide to do this. You people can see these are two shades of dark, but this one is darker, this one is darker, and this one is slightly darker but it looks really good and then of course you pull it up like that and then there you go you see it combines really well and it pops really well um this one this jacket i thrifted in when i was going to work i don't remember the place but i think it's there after naiva supermarket when i was going to work i thrifted this one there it was around 500 this jacket college jacket it's quite heavy good for the cold weathers and then this top of course kirinyaga road i got i got it for 200 shillings and guys i've told you if you're plus size don't do this okay don't do this because this one will make your potty look bigger but if you're plus size you can try tucking a little bit like that of course my belt is ikombali so i cannot put it on but you see guys the difference there's a difference there of course yes the time is there but um the waist look at the waist the waist is looking much better and of course look at that it's looking much better so that's rule number one for how you dress look for darker shades um to be how will i say to be on the better side of it look for darker shades and again avoid having tight clothes going over your stomach okay because it affirms you understand but if you do this you get your of course there's a tummy here but most people will be more on your curvature side which of course i'm saying um you don't look more explicit or trying to sell yourself but again you're trying to make your curves look better you understand making your calves look better and hiding the inadequate you know you like it perfect imperfections hiding the imperfections and making them perfect so that's how you do it and again another rule 
wear your confidence okay wear your confidence you can have the best clothes you can have the best designers you can have the best makeup but if your confidence is down then nobody will notice your clothes but you can have the cheapest clothes but your confidence will be the best and everyone will be wow 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 believe in me not many people are obviously i'm plus size but not many people when i sit with them or when i'm chatting with them plus size comes into my no because most of the times i try to make um, my features the features that are more popping to look better and try to hide those that zitafanya watu they judge me or they say this and this and this and another thing i've accepted myself so of course my self esteem my kwangi uko chini so that's another thing and show sure, however you dress it looks good and this one i got it from kirinyaga road um it was going for 450 shillings but of course my bargaining power i got it for 350 shillings which was good and it's fitting really well and if i can show you my toes let me show you hey, can you guys see you see how my eh you see how my toes were done zilifanyika zilifanywa zikani kama zimechanuliwa chanuliwa huko chini they put some design there i'll take a photo and show you guys so that's my first clothes that what am i saying that's my first dress up let's go to the second one okay and you guys if you have um how will i say it hacks for ensuring hair don't go bad easily tell me because this hair has not finished one week and look how it's looking man <sighs> anyway let's go to the second one right now so guys um uh, we are done with the first outfit this is the second outfit um from my thrifting so this one i got it also at kirinyaga road it's cute little thing i got it from kirinyaga road it's going for it was going for something like how much was it going for um 200 no 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 no. they did it for me at 150 yes it was going for 200 but of course bargaining bargaining people bargaining i got it for 150 and these are more mommy jeans but quite fitting they're more mommy jeans but they're quite fitting so these ones i got them for from 350 350 yes of course all of them was they were being sold to me at 450 but i bought three of them so they sold each at 350 and because of doing the how is like kuchanuo kochini they did it for 50 shillings so total was like 1100 for three trousers so look how cute it looks these are mommy jeans they're mommy jeans and wow so another thing for plus size girls as plus size girls if you're going to wear something bright like this ensure it has thick fabric yani fabric nzito kama yangu si light ensure it has thick fabric because thick fabric in a nika ku illusion say how come no no sana you understand it makes you look good especially on photos like this one see how it looks see how it looks and then there's this just a little bit of skin here there and then what i put on top is let me show you guys right now so what i'll put on top is this these are denim on denim you understand so that's what i can put on top to make it look good yeah So this one I got for 150. This one I got it for 200. That is, uh, no, this one I got it for 350. 150 that is 500. So I'm wearing 500. And this one I got it for 200 at Huruma. At Huruma. So generally whatever I'm wearing here except the jewelry is 700. And you'll walk and nobody will know you're wearing 700. Okay. So there we go. How does this one look, guys? And sure you choose for me which looks better. Which one looks better? Which one looks better? The first one with the black top or this one with the red top and the denim vibe? Guys, tell me which one looks good, okay? But I kind of feel I love this one more. Okay. Let's go to the third one, okay? 
So again, this is the third outfit. Um, I had to repeat this one because it kind of looked cute. I had to repeat it. But this one I got it at Kirinyaga Road at 200 shillings. And this mommy jeans, mommy jeans, these ones. These ones. I got them at 350 shillings. So those are the three jeans that I got. You guys tell me which is your best, best look. I kind of love this vibe. And again, remember what I've told you. My big girls, don't wear bright clothes with thin material. Because in a fanyanga, it's like wearing a bandage dress. And you have three tummies. Unless you're going to do some kufunga na mshipi. Maybe that will look good. But again, you understand, zile mtumbotatu, ile auji, ya chakula na yamaji. Yes, those ones will show. But if you don't want them to show, just wear dark clothes. You understand? You see like this one, you can see a little bit of stomach here. It's it's a crop top, yes. But it, it doesn't look that, oh, it doesn't look that. You understand? Kuna zile tumbo zile nonanga za mtu like, ai. But this one, but if I had worn it below Kuchini, kuna ile tumbo inge, you understand? So it would have looked mm -mm, really bad, really bad. But this one, at least it, it flats a bit. And you have this cover-up. So yeah, that looks good. And you can decide also to tuck in your cover-up to make it look like that. That's how it's looking. And I'm loving every bit of this vibe i'm loving every minute of it so guys this is that look um everything costed me 200 200 150 that is 200 150 that is 550 plus 1100 that is 550 plus 1100 so that is what costed me for those clothes that I've shown you. And yeah. And I'm loving this one. Because Zina bring some beachy vibe. Beach, beach. See, yani kule kwa ocean. Beachy vibe. And yeah, you're looking good. You look good. And of course, I'll have my watch. And I'll have my... You guys, if you've not watched uh, my ring light video, I've shared where I got my smartwatch from. I'll wear my watch. I'll wear my sunny, sunny sanitation watch kuna ile watch flani unaikanga inaitwa ngaje unaikanga uh, sanitizer ndani let me show you this one most people confuse it for a watch but this one is good for if you like me i don't like carrying handbags and i have bags but i don't really like carrying them so this one i put my sanitizer through here i have a tube that in a cup on dani and then i just wear it like a watch so if i right now it's empty but if i want sanitizer i just do this and it goes to my hand and i sanitize and i'm done for the day so of course i'll be having this and you understand you'll be looking all good in that and yeah so that's the look for my thrift that's how i look and of course i got shoes but those shoes are just niche shoes normal to open, you understand, flats. They're not really, and of course those cost almost the same everywhere, 500. So yeah, that I won't show you at in howl or hat or what or what or what. We are to nava, sandals nava, just know the hack of looking good, know what to combine wear. Okay, you can wear anything, but when you know how to combine it, it looks really, really good for you. So yeah, you guys. Uh, the ladies plus size bodies if you have low self-esteem watch this maybe it will motivate you wear what you want as long as it looks good on you as long as you feel comfortable with it as long as and again you don't look really how will I call it um, really so you want to look respectable but again you want to look class you want to look good you want to feel good about your body so ensure you know where to get your clothes, where to get where, what. I don't have a specific place that I buy my clothes. For me, any clothes that I pass on the road and it will look good on me, that's what I buy. I don't have a chinendanga kwa huyu, kwa huyu, kwa huyu, no. I won't lie to you. So anyway, I get good clothes, that's where I buy. So yeah, that's, those are my dresses for today. At dresses, no. Those are my outfits for today. And of course, I'll be going for... A small vacation so on that vacation maybe i'll be wearing some of this 
you never know but mostly the trousers i know that i'll be carrying but of course for the tops because it's a work vacation i can't wear the tops because of you know these so i'll be avoiding that oh guys and i got a biker shot let me show you the biker shot the biker shot i got it for 200 shillings in a few let me show you oh and i forgot and sure you tell me is it outfit one outfit two or outfit three that had it for you okay you guys tell me which was your best look for me i think i love the second outfit it, look, it looked really good but you guys tell me which was your best look so guys uh my baker my baker shot i got it for 200 shillings but i didn't buy any any top that could go with the biker shot so i had to wear this one and this one i had it before but guys if you want to wear your biker shot to look good and your plus size don't wear something that goes like this because of your tummy so you wear something that just ensure ukumusho, you just tuck it in a little bit like that so that will ensure that at least unaka vizuri because it's hiding this part of the tummy or others do it like this others do it like this which is still okay it's still okay it will still look good so you just decide on what looks good on you and you tuck it in the side that you like but for me i like tucking it in on one side yeah like that i like it like that and then i fold it like that so these are the biker shots that i got the biker shots i got them at i got them at 200 shillings and i love them <laughs> in this century who doesn't have a biker shot so yeah and i love them of course it i'll be doing them maybe when i'm going to work out or when i'm going to hike something like that but mostly it should be for indoors so of course this one i'm not going with it anywhere um it should be for indoors and yeah i love it 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 but it's a laid down look so you decide if you don't like biker shots do what you like you understand do you do you you understand your body you understand what you like so don't don't try to compete with someone else. The thing that we make mistake with is all of us want to try out that body. Honey, that clothes that, that that dress doesn't come with the body, that trouser doesn't come with the body, that shoe doesn't come with the leg. So ensure you wear what fits you. Look for your own style. Watch out copy styles of a celeb because these people are selling their clothes, they are selling, they are they have been paid to become influencers. So you will go with the influencing part and you forget. That clothes that your dress I could in a mwili. Eh, if it's not gonna your cloth I could in a mwili. So what I know when I know you start having low self-esteem, you start feeling bad about yourself, you start going on hunger strikes. Guys, accept your body. If you want to lose weight, well and good, do you? If you don't lose weight, understand your body, look for what looks good on you, have courage, you understand? Ile unatembe everybody knows any by the way, I'm a dependa venyako. But if you go with your head like this. Imagine I was dressed like this, and then when I'm walking, I'm like, you understand? Nobody, everybody will be like, Kwani, I feel comfortable now. It's the same way we feel when someone is wearing a short dress, and they go like, they are pulling it down. You understand? We are like, come on, live a full piece. We are full piece joined. Don't try to make yourself look uncomfortable before us. If you're feeling comfortable with a short dress, walk with that short dress. Be comfortable in it. So for me, I'm like, if if you don't have that confidence, if you are wearing something like this, honey, walk with that confidence. Let everybody know you're walking and you're owning your own space, you're owning your own clothes, okay? Yes, so that was my haul. Oh, guys, and I got traveling bags. Of course, I, was, I told you I'm going for a work vacation, so I had to get traveling bags. Um, Yeah, so let me show you my traveling bags. Guess from where? Ebony and Bienny from where in the comments? Tell me, tell me, tell me. Where do you guys think I could get my bags from? One and only place in a short while. So guys, uh, my bag, I got it from, yeah, Denry, as I was telling you. It was part of my shopping today, and I got it, it's an offer, I got it for 3500 and yeah, you can get yours too. It comes with this backpack, um, yeah, for the small things that you need to carry and the bigger bag for your clothes so mine will be like a one week um work conference or vacation work conference vacation stroke yeah because obviously i'll be going also to unwind 
so yeah and all my things are fitted in that bag and there's more space and this one it's for carrying notebooks that i don't want to dig in that deep in that bag for me to get them so yeah there we go and there are various colors so you can go get yours 3500 only for the two packages Show me this other fake to you now I wanna wake up with 